Hey, good morning guys. This is Pushpak Raj and today's topic is on how to create the test case template on OYO application. So we are all aware about the OYO application. This is the application which will be used for booking the online hotels. Okay. So the project name is the OYO application created by Shubham. Shubham is a tester name who can create the test cases on OYO application. Okay. Creation date on which date he can create it on 27th of November 2022. On that date, he can create the test cases. Reviewed by Pushpak Raj is a senior authority of the team who can review by the test cases on the same date. Okay, so this is the test case template format, guys. Before start the video, I have created the multiple test case template format on different domain like banking domain, telecom domain, e-commerce, healthcare. Okay, so such a kind of uh, test case template format which will be available on the channel also related to the automation testing manual testing and related to the interview questions uh, which will be asked the maximum time in the interview which will be covered in the channel so for that purpose just hit the bell icon and uh, subscribe the video so you can getting the upcoming videos whatever the videos i can upload it on the channel okay so this is the format so this is the test case id this is the test case name test case description preconditions test tapes expected result actual result final result and comment so this is the test case template format guys sometimes in the interview you just ask the that role like uh, what is the test case id what is the test case name and what uh, what is the structure of the test case template so you can just tell us that that one okay Okay, so let's see one by one what is the test case of OYO application. This is the first test case that is this stands for test case OYO. This is the application name and 001. This is the first test case. Test case name is user registration. So uh, you have to register any ap application before using. Okay, so first what is the condition that you have to download that application from the play store and then you can uh, work on that application or then, then you can use that application so likewise user registration okay so the test case description for that verify that a user can successfully register to the OYO applications okay so free condition means before the condition that is the free condition means the user has OYO app installed we am I am already told you guys the OYO application which will be available on the play store ios store you can download that application from anywhere for your sake of understanding means what kind of functionality which will be available on the application okay so this is the user uh, the user has the OYO application installed means the user can install the application from anyone store like play store uh, uh, ios store okay so that is not a thing okay move on the test step so what are the steps to be followed to download the application or to open the application so steps are the open the OYO application okay so whatever the application you can download from the play store firstly what you need uh, what you need to open that application then click on the sign up button enter the valid registration details and click on the registered button so these are the steps to be follow for registration purpose okay so what is click on the sign up page once you can click on the sign up page uh, you can getting the number of uh, fields like name father's name mother's name uh, address so such a kind of um, text field which will be available there you have to enter your personal details there okay enter the valid registration details and click on the registration button once you can click on the registration buttons means whatever the data you can fill on that text field that which will be submitted to the OYO okay so according to that you can register to the OYO application so what is the expected result you have expected the user should be registered successfully and directed to the home screen okay so that is the expected result okay once the expected result and actual result is matched means test case is passed if the expected and actual is not matched means test case is fail in the comment part you can write the comment according to your testing okay move on the second test case that is the hotel search i am already told you guys this application is used for searching the hotels booking the hotels okay so main motto of that application hotel search okay so verify that user can search the hotel based on the specific criteria okay so what uh, in the star uh, star pattern the hotels is 
available here like uh, there is a five star on the particular hotels means all the facility which will be available on the hotels which are good if you are getting the uh, 4.5 star or uh, four and a half star or three star two star means the whatever the facility which will be available on the hotel is less though okay so according to that hotel search okay so description is verified that user can search for the hotels based on sp specified criteria okay so for that purpose the precondition is the user is logged in okay so this is the precondition so what are the steps to be followed for hotel search open the OYO applications enter the this, this uh, destination and details uh, dates and click on the search okay so these are the step to be follow for hotel search okay so the expected result is a list available hotels meeting the specific criteria is display so whatever the criteria required by the customer which will be display or not that we are that is the our expected condition means expected and actual match means test case is pass otherwise test case is fail okay move on the third case uh, test case that is the room booking okay user that can use the book a room successfully okay so this is the description so for that purpose what is the precondition the user has a search for available hotels okay so this is the first condition or precondition so what are the steps to be follow select the hotels choose a room type enter the guest details and click on the book now button okay so once you can search the hotel you need to book a particular hotels because you have to know that there are the multiples ac or non ac uh, rooms are available or according to the price the rooms facility which will be available so what kind of rooms you are you want so according to that you can follow that step to room booking of a particular hotels so what expected result you want the user should receive a booking confirmation with reservation details whatever the room booked by the users that confirmation message which will be issued through the mail through the sms through the whatsapp to the customer so that is the expected result so the customer feel comfortable that our room is booked so that is the our expected result so expected and actual match means test case is passed otherwise test case is fail okay so for test case is payment process once you can follow the steps like hotel search room bookings but next step is process the payment or payment process okay so for that purpose verify that payment process is smooth and secure so precondition is the user has valid booking okay so the step to be follow click on pay now enter the payment details and complete the payment process okay so this is the step to be follow for doing the payment expected result is the payment should be successful and user should receive a payment confirmation so whatever the payment which will be done by the user for a particular hotels or rooms the confirmation message of whatever the payment done to the customers email through or whatsapp through confirmation received which will be received to the customer or not that we have to check here okay so the whatever the expectation of our and whatever the actual result so on the basis of that every testing which will be performed on every application guys so according to that you can performing the testing in your organization or you can use such a kind of mindset to performing the testing on any applications so it is the best way okay so the selection of the interview is 100 percent of your guys be focused okay move on the fifth test case that is booking cancellation okay once you can booking the hotels but uh, what customer want to book the now uh, cancel the booking hotels okay so for that purpose what is the step verify that user can cancel a booking this is the test description so the uh, precondition is user has valid booking before cancellation the user has valid booking is necessary so what are the step to be follows go to my bookings then select the booking to cancel and click on the cancel booking so whatever the hotels or rooms booked by the customer they are easily cancelled or not that you have to check or for that purpose you have to follow that steps so what expected result you want the booking should be cancelled and the user should be received the cancellation confirmation so that is the expected result or once the expected and actual match means test case is fast otherwise test case is fail move on the six test case that is the user profile update okay so verify that user can update their profile okay so this is the test description so for that purpose the precondition is user is logged in okay go to 
that are the step to be follow for that update the profile okay so the step are go to my profile click on edit profile update the profile information and click on save the changes this is the step to be follow for user update purpose the user profile information should be updated successfully okay this is the pop up message which will be shown that you are whatever the information which will be updated by the customer that are updated successfully okay so free condition and the expected result match means whatever the expectation of the tester so that is fulfilled or whatever the expectation of the customer that is fulfilled means that is the actual result okay so means test case is fast otherwise if not match means test case is fail move on the last test case that is the review the submission okay so verify that user can submit a review for the book hotel okay so whatever the facility which will be getting by the customer on the particular hotels on the basis of that they can giving the reviews on the basis of stars i am already told you guys there are the five star facility if you are getting on the particular hotel means you can giving the out of five star you can getting the five star if you are not getting the expected facility you can giving the four stars three stars okay so so according to that customer giving the stars to the particular hotel on the basis of his whatever the facility they have to provided by the hotels okay so the user has completed a stay means for that purpose user has completed the stay so step to be follow for that go to my booking select the completed booking and click on write a review and submit the review okay these are the step to be follow for giving the review to the particular hotel the expected result is the review should be submitted and visible for the respective hotels okay so this is the expected and actual match means test case is fast means test case is fast is means like whatever the review given by the customers so expected result is that review which will be seen to the hotels or all the public which will be uh, think that about booking that hotel so before that the another pe uh, people's or public which will be try to search that how much star, uh, hotel how much stars which will be provided by the previous customer to the particular hotel on the basis of that also uh the public which will book the hotels okay so star uh, star facility or review submission is the best important thing or most important thing in the particular hotels okay so expected actual match means test case is pass so according to that guys i have creating the multiple test cases on nokri.com banking domain related then manual testing related automation testing related test scenarios test cases multiple videos which will be available regarding the automation testing manual testing relating the software okay so for that purpose just like the video subscribe the video hit the bell icon so you have to getting the upcoming videos related to the particular domain so thank you guys for watching the videos have a good day